Hi, I'm Lily Lambda, and today I'm showcasing beta version 1.0 of my Easy Mod Mover. Before we begin, if you're not from the Game Banana page for this tool by some miracle, there's more information there. This is a tool to make switching slots significantly less tedious. It can't do much more than just rename files, so if a mod includes a config.json file, you need to edit that separately. It also doesn't implement anything new, like switching Inklings ink color or anything. I've combined a few of my mods into a testing mod to showcase some of EMM's uses, so let's have a look. As you can see, when I select the directory, every mod in the directory shows up, and I can select as many as I want. There's then three options of what I can do with the selected mods. Delete is pretty simple. You can see clearly, if I search it up, that there's a Polyutena mod in the folder. But if I don't want this Polyutena mod, I can click on it, click delete, and if I search the folder for Polyutena again, I don't even have to, you can see that there's nothing in the folder with Polyutena in it, meaning all traces of the mod in that folder are now gone. Now I just select the directory again, and you can see that Polyutena is gone from there too. Delete also works for as many mods as you want, so if I've had enough of, say, this Ike and this Squirtle, I can make both of them disappear in one fail swoop. The Switch Selected To button changes the slot of a single mod. It's pretty obvious that if I search for Daisy, there's a Daisy mod on CO3. But once I select the mod, hit CO5, and hit Switch, all of its files switch to CO5. But if I wanted my newly renamed Daisy CO5 mod to be on CO7, there's already a mod on the CO7 slot. To swap the two mods around, I can select the two mods and hit swap, and their slots will, well, swap. To demonstrate another thing with Switch, you can see that on Master CO5, Master not only has a body folder, which is on CO5, but a background folder for Final Smash, which is also on CO5. If I want to switch this to CO3, it'll also include the background folder in addition to the body folder. This also works for audio. I have a Bylet CO3 mod with audio, so if I'd like to switch that to 7, you'll notice that this very specifically named file also changes to CO7. And that's about it for the showcase. If anyone finds any bugs or issues, please leave a comment on the Game Banana page or message me on Discord, both of which you can find in the description.